Georg von Bekezi Hungarian Bekezi Georg IPA BKI the 3rd of June 1899 to the 13th of June 1972 was a Hungarian biophysicist born in Budapest Hungary In 1961 he was awarded the Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine for his research on the function of the cochlea in the mammalian hearing organ Topic <inaudible> Biography <inaudible> Bekezi was born on 3 June 1899 in Budapest, Hungary, the first of three children Georg 1899, Lola 1901 and Miklos 1903 to Alexander von Bekezi an economic diplomat born in Kolesvar, Austria-Hungary Romania. The Bekezi family was originally reformed but converted to Catholicism. His mother, Paula Mazzoli (1877–1974), was born in Kadavica, Austria-Hungary, now Croatia. His maternal grandfather was from Pex. He went to school in Budapest, Munich, and Zurich. He studied chemistry in Bern and received his PhD in physics on the subject "fast way of determining molecular weight" from the University of Budapest in 1926. He then spent one year working in an engineering firm. He published his first paper on the pattern of vibrations of the inner ear in 1928. He was offered a position at Uppsala University by Robert Barani, which he dismissed because of the hard Swedish winters. Before and during World War II, Bekezi worked for the Hungarian Post Office 1923 to 1946, where he did research on telecommunication signal quality. This research led him to become interested in the workings of the ear. In 1946, he left Hungary to follow this line of research at the Karolinska Institute in Sweden. In 1947, he moved to the United States, working at Harvard University until 1966. In 1962 he was elected a member of the German Academy of Sciences Leopoldina. After his lab was destroyed by fire in 1965, he was offered to lead a research laboratory of sense organs in Honolulu, Hawaii. He became a professor at the University of Hawaii in 1966 and died in Honolulu. He became a well-known expert in Asian art. He had a large collection which he donated to the Nobel Foundation in Sweden. His brother, Dr. Miklos Bekezi (1903–1980), stayed in Hungary and became a famous agrobiologist who was awarded the Kossuth Prize. Topic: Research. Bekezi developed a method for dissecting the inner ear of human cadavers while leaving the cochlea partly intact. By using strobe photography and silver flakes as a marker, he was able to observe that the basilar membrane moves like a surface wave when stimulated by sound. Because of the structure of the cochlea and the basilar membrane, different frequencies of sound cause the maximum amplitudes of the waves to occur at different places on the basilar membrane along the coil of the cochlea. High frequencies cause more vibration at the base of the cochlea while low frequencies create more vibration at the apex. He concluded that his observations showed how different sound wave frequencies are locally dispersed before exciting different nerve fibers that lead from the cochlea to the brain. He theorized that the placement of each sensory cell, hair cell along the coil of the cochlea corresponds to a specific frequency of sound, the so-called tonotopy. Bekezi later developed a mechanical model of the cochlea, which confirmed the concept of frequency dispersion by the basilar membrane in the mammalian cochlea. But this model could not provide any information as to a possible function of this frequency dispersion in the process of hearing. In a posthumous 1974 article looking back over progress in the field, he remarked, in time, I came to the conclusion that the dehydrated cats and the application of Fourier analysis to hearing problems became more and more a handicap for research in hearing." Referring to the difficulties in getting animal preparations to behave as when alive, and the misleading common interpretations of Fourier analysis in hearing research. <laughs> Awards Bekezi's honors include the Denker Prize in Otology 1931, the Leibniz Medal of the Berlin Academy of Sciences 1937, the Guillot Prize for Speech and Otology of Groningen University 1939, the Academy Award of the Budapest Academy of Science 1946, Schambau Prize in Otology 1950.
Honorary doctorates MD were conferred on him by the University of Munster 1955, Bern 1959, Padua 1962, Buenos Aires 1968, Cordoba 1968, Hawaii 1969 and Semmelweis University, Budapest 1969. Topic references. Topic further reading. Chesel, Andrew E. 2004. Famous Hungarian physicians. Lancet, 364, 9434, pp. 581-2, doi, 10.1016, S0140673604-16847-5, PMID 156. Evans, Rand B. 2003. Georg von Bekesey, Visualization of Hearing. The American Psychologist, published September 2003, 58, 9, pp. 742-6, doi, 10.1037, 0003-066 extension 58.9.742, PMID 14584991. Raju, T. N. The Nobel Chronicles. 1961, Georg von Bekesey, 1899 to 1972. Lancet, published July 3, 1999, 354, 9172, p. 80. Doi 10.1016/s0140673605-7535. PMID 10406402. Shampo, M. A., Kyle, R. A. 1993. Georg von Bekesey Audiology and the Cochlea. Mayo Klin. Proc, published July 1993, 68, 7, p. 706, doi, 10.1016 per seconds 0025 6196 12 60608 9, PMID 8350644. Tundorf, J. 1986. Georg von Bekesey and his work. Here. Res. 22, pp. 3-10, doi, 10.1016-0378-5955-86-90067-5, PMID 3525485. Bernhard, C. G. 1986. Georg von Bekesey and the Karolinska Institute. Here. Res. 22, pp. 13-7, doi, 10.1016-0378-5955-86-90069-9, PMID 3525483. Proceedings of Nobel Symposium 63. Cellular Mechanisms in Hearing N. Homage a Georg von Bekesey. Karlskoga, 2-6 September 1985. Here. Res. 22, pp. 1 to 326, 1986, PMID 3525481. Tundorf, J. 1974. In memoriam Georg von Bekesey 1899 to 1972. J. Acoust. Soc. Am. Published March 1974, 55, 3, pp. 576-7, Bibcode, 1974ASAJ. 0.55576t doi 10.1121/1.1914566 PMID 4594785 Glorig A 1973 Georg von Bekesey 1899 to 1972 Audiology, 12 5, pp. 542-1, doi, 10.3109-0020609730907167, PMID 4582926 Keitel, W. D. In Memoriam Professor Dr. Phil. Dr. Med. H. C. Georg V. Bekesey. 
Kybernetic, published February 1973, 12, 2, pp. 116-8, doi, 10.1007, BF00272468, PMID 4571620, Ratliff, F. 1973. Georg von Bekesey. Experimental Brain Research. Experimentellhirnforschung. Experimentation Cerebrale published January 29, 1973, 16 3, pp. 219-20, PMID 4568685. Keitel, W. D. 1973. In memoriam Professor Dr. Phil. Dr. Med. H. C. Georg von Bekesey. Zeitschrift für Laryngologie, Rhinologie, Otologie und IHRE Grenzgebiete, published January 1973, 52, 1, pp. 1 to 6, PMID 4567951. Davis, H. 1972. Georg von Bekesey, 1899–1972. Ann. Otal. Reinal. Luringel, published October 1972, 81, 5, pp. 752-1, doi, 10.1177, 3489 Zwislotsky, J. J. Georg von Bekesey, 1899–1972. J. Akust. S.O.C. M. Published October 1972, 52 4, pp. 1094–5, PMID 4563147. Georg von Bekesey. Asha, 14, 9, p. 513, Sep 1972, ISSN 0001 2475, PMID 4560564. Tundorf, J. Obituary for Georg von Bekesey. Archive für Klinisch und Experimentelle Ohren Nason und Kelkopfheikunde, 203, 1, pp. 81-5, doi, 10.1007, BF00344566, PMID 4564741. The American Speech and Hearing Association presents the honors of the association. Asha published June 1967, 9-6, p. 222, 1967, PMID 5343023. Bernhard, C. G. 1962. Presentation of the Nobel Prize for Physiology or Medicine 1961 to George von Bekesy. Transactions of the American Otological Society, 50, pp. 332-6, PMID 13971073. Keitel, W.D. 1961. G. von Bekesey Nobel Prize winner 1961. Zeitschrift für Laryngologie, Rhinologie, Otologie und IHRE Grenzgebiete published December 1961, 40, pp. 885-8, PMID 14037041 Palva, T. 1961. The 1961 Nobel Prize in Medical Science and Physiology Georg von Bekesey Duodecim, Lachetitilin and Eikakauskerja, 77, pp. 791-2, PMID 14037251 External links Nobel Prize Biography Georg von Bekesey page at the Pacific Biosciences Research Center Bekesey Laboratory of Neurobiology website Bekesey Art Collection My Experiences in Different Laboratories, Autobiographical Speech by Von Bekesey The Ear Pages Game